your almost to a hundred point lead. Did you guys recognize that? Was there uh, I mean, any acknowledgement of? I mean, any type of game. We look at the scoreboard. I mean, we said something about it, but I mean, that wasn't our goal. It just kind of happened. When you think about that, that you that you led a basketball game by one hundred points. I mean, I've never done it before. I'm hundred <laughs> percent. Well, I'm not hundred percent sure, but I'm like ninety five percent sure. Nobody on this team has done it, but uh, I mean, we did it. And, I mean, we're not thinking too much of it. We just got to get uh, move on to the next game. Yeah, Coach you talked about 29 dunks. I mean, it seemed like a dunk contest midway through the first half. How fun is it to play a game like that? Uh, I mean, it's fun, but uh, I mean, we're, we're not really getting better like that. I mean, uh, we put up a lot of points today, and I mean, that I, I didn't realize we dunked the ball that much. I got hung on a dunk. <laughs> 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 uh, that's what I remember, but uh, I mean, it happened, and it's just, it's just time to move on. How did Briscoe miss that layup? I don't know. I I was I, I think he got the steal and I, I stayed down court because I thought he was gonna make it. He missed and but he got it back and then shot another layup. So he, I'm not gonna say he made up for it, but he made another. He made a layup after that. He didn't make up for it. I thought he was done. I thought he was done the second one. Just to nah, he got his dunk in in the first half. He's done for the year. <laughs> <laughs> Cal, Cal, Cal likes to talk about Bam's energy. Is, is he the sweatiest guy you've ever played with? Mm, no, no, he's not. Nah. <laughs> I can think, I can, it was like sixth grade, I was doing with a guy, I don't remember his name, but he, not nah, bam, that's what he's got for him. But he's looking, the guy looks like he's always like worked into a, a yeah, yeah, total I mean, sweat and, and, and put forth maximum energy. I mean, he puts a lot of work in before the game, and uh, I mean, during the game, he plays he plays with such a high motor, he's going to sweat a lot. So. Coach has it said after this game and the first one, he wants you guys to post more. How come that's not happening? How come you our guys aren't looking? Uh, for the post up? I mean, I don't know. In practice, honestly, we work on it a lot, but uh, mm -hmm. I mean, sometimes you just got to translate some things to a game, and that's what we're trying to do right now. What did you think of Michael Mulder? I'm sorry. What did you think of Michael Mulder tonight? Oh, Mike played very well. I mean, he went after rebounds. He he just did what Kyle told him to do, play with more energy. Uh, he made shots, which every, I mean, everybody in the gym knows he can make shots. Uh, I don't think some people knew he's as, he's, uh, as athletic as he is, but I mean, we see it in practice every day. He, he torches us when we play like the three guards and like against him and Dom or something. Uh, he, he, he be killing us some, sometimes in practice. So, uh, I mean, for me, it was, it was good to see him do it in the game. It feels like Cal wants you to just go, 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 and, and he, that you're sometimes not even going fast enough for him. How much do you like that he wants you basically to, to step on the gas and go? I mean, I love it, but he, uh, he's preached it to me as soon as I got on campus. Uh, I mean, in high school, you know, he'd always say how, how casual I am or um, how I like to play with the ball because I can handle it. And uh, I mean, sometimes, sometimes I do, I do play with the ball, play with the defender. But uh, when I do use my speed the way he wants me to, it, it hasn't, it hasn't hurt me yet. Huh? Um, what do you think the post-up game can do for you guys? You haven't really needed it, obviously. Um, yeah, but why? Why? why uh, it's going to be big, just because I mean, everyone always talks about our back court, but no one really talks about our front court. Uh, I don't think people think our front court is as good as we think it is. So, I mean, when they when those guys play big, I feel like I feel like we can't lose. Um, I mean, sometimes your guard is going to have an off night, so you're going to have to be able to throw it in, uh, throw it in the Bam, Sasha, um, Isaac, Ty. You know, those guys got to do what they do, and then once we just go in, inside and out, they're able to kick it out, and we're getting open shots. So I mean, we got to have a good big play. What are those 29 dunks? Which one stood out to you? And who's the best dunker on the team? The best dunker on the team, I would say Bam. Well, I'm not counting Bam. I'm saying Malik. And the best dunk tonight, of course, was Mike's. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's without question. That's definitely without question. It's not even close. What are those battles between those big guys like in practice? Uh, it's crazy. Um, we, we go through drills. And, like, if they don't do something right, it's like, go again, go again. And then sometimes they'll do it right. And he'll be like, that's what you're supposed to do. Now do it again. So, uh, I mean, it, it gets intense in practice. Rather, it's guards, wings, bigs, anything. I mean, uh, our practice is very intense. What's the comfort level for you guys being out there to start the game? Uh, the three guards, or yeah. um, I mean, it's I mean, we we all have good chemistry off the court, so I mean, it's been easy for us to you know to gel together on the court, even though we haven't been doing it for too long. Uh, I mean, I feel like we know each other's tendencies, and it's just been easy for us to play together now, and uh, we all just feed off of each other. It seemed like the whole bench had a pretty big reaction to Mike's dunk there at the end. What was that like for you guys? Oh man, it was crazy. I mean, Mike's dunked on people in practice. I'm not gonna say who. I know y'all gonna ask, but I'm not gonna tell y'all who he dunked on. But uh, <laughs> it's, uh, I mean, anybody should. I mean, it's your teammate, and he just made a big play. So, I mean, we we, we get hyped for our, for our teammates. We're trying to be good teammates. Uh, I mean, that's that, that's one key thing that I like to focus on, just being a good teammate. Because uh, 
I mean, even if y'all are down, you've got to be a good teammate to get everybody back up. So. And he's a guy kind of fighting the, to get that rotation once the season starts. What have you seen from him just during practice? Oh, man. I, honestly, Mike, I mean, during the summer, I didn't I didn't know who Mike was when I came in. But during the summer, man, he didn't miss shots. He was dunking. Uh, he played. He, I mean, uh, I heard him he wasn't playing defense last year. But, uh, I mean, he's been defending well this year. So, uh, I mean, he's done nothing but impress me since I've got on campus. And, I mean, he's one of the older guys, one of the veterans. So, He's been teaching us, just telling us what to do, and uh, I mean, he's he's been a big part of helping me get better here. Ty said with his mask, he would like to have had a Batman mask to come out and play on the court and stuff like that. Ty? Yeah. Ty crazy. <laughs> he seems to have a pretty good sense of humor. Oh, he definitely does. I mean, our entire team has a sense of humor. I mean, guys don't see it because all they really see is us playing basketball on the court, and that's when we're serious. But off the court, I mean, we're... It's a, it's a it's a real it's a real good bunch. With the amount of fun you guys have off the court, how much does that translate to on the court and chemistry and that kind of thing? Since you all have individual goals, but you're obviously meshing them together for the team. I mean, since we're all so comfortable with each other, I feel like uh, it's helped us on the court just because I mean we can tell each other like we don't have to sugarcoat anything. You know, um, you know someone's telling you something for the better for you and the team. So. Uh, Guys, we, we all listen to each other. We all take account what each other say. We keep each other accountable. We keep ourselves accountable. So uh, it's just helped us on the court. So as you can say, I mean, it's not personal, so it's cool and there's no hangover. Yeah, yeah, nothing's personal with this team. I mean, uh, if, if I tell Isaiah something, he, he listens. If Isaiah tells Derek something, he listens. So, I mean, we all listen to each other just because we know that that's going to help us. There are several players, or players, people, that are comparing you to John Wall with your speed and your ball handling skills. Do you? See that as uh, a challenge or pressure, or do you embrace that as motivation? Uh, I embrace it. I mean, John was, a, John was the number one pick in the draft, so if I can do anything close to what he's doing, I mean, I, I would be cool with it. But uh, I mean, I see the I see the comparisons. I see you know our similarities in the game, but uh, I mean, I still feel like we're different players. But uh, it's a, it's a he's a really good guy to be compared to, though. <laughs> There are worse things in life that could happen. Yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely. Do you think tonight served maybe warning the future opponents that they should not intentionally speed the game up against you guys? Um, honestly, yeah. I mean, uh, I feel like we're, I kind of feel like we're too athletic for you to speed us up just because we already want to play fast. So if someone wants to play fast with us, we're perfectly fine with that. But uh, we just kind of, we already kind of know how people are kind of going to play us. We don't, we don't. We honestly don't think, I mean, that team presses, and we already knew that. So we knew coming in the game, we probably weren't going to be able to run too much offense, uh, get a lot of layups and lobs. So I don't feel like teams, I don't even think teams, you know, needed this game to know, you know, not to want to speed the game up with us.